So ESR just sent me these two products, wireless car charger, classic kickstand case. Should you buy them? Let's find out. So I'll start with the case. There is a big unique selling point with this case, which I'll get to shortly. It's a clear TPU case and it's got anti-yellow technologies. Hopefully it won't stain like some cases do. I've been using it on a daily basis for the past seven days. So I could give you guys a full and detailed review. So let's put the phone in the case and have a look. But just before I do, as you can see on the inside here, Halo Lock Magnetic Case. That's the name for ESR's MagSafe technology that they use on all their products. Anyone who's not aware of ESR, they come with some of the best and strongest magnets out of any cases and accessories that I've tried before. I'll demonstrate that later in the video, so make sure you hold on to see how strong they are. Okay, so you can see, we've got the phone in the case, and as I said, there are some smudges on there, but it's because I've been using it every day. Clear TPU case, hard on the back and softer on the sides. And then just up here, you'll see we've got a nice camera bump. Let's just see how protective that is before I show you a pretty cool feature. So as you can see, there's quite a significant bump around the camera lens. So you're not gonna Damage your phone if it breaks because you're well protected. One cool party trick on here, I'll show you in a minute. We're just getting to the sides. We've got the buttons and the ESR logo just there. As you look at the bottom, your ports are well covered, there's plenty of protection. And in each corner, you can see we've got a little cushion technology. So if you drop it, it just takes the weight a bit and the corners will just help it bounce and absorb the shock so your phone doesn't get broken, hopefully. You've got a slot for your lanyard there. And as you can see, there's a ridged dot matrix technology on the inside of the case moving on to the buttons so you've got volume buttons there and your mute switch let's see how easy that is to access no problems accessing that buttons let's do a button test buttons absolutely fine actually no problem with those buttons nice and clicky okay so let's go back to that feature that I mentioned so the big selling point of this case alongside the strong magnets is actually the ring that goes around the camera the reason I say that is a feature is because you can actually lift it up and then that then becomes a kickstand consuming media or on YouTube or something like that great experience for that and it's something it has over other cases also what I've been doing the last few days because that opens and closes I just slot my hand in there and I'm gonna read something it just sits on the back of there. I don't have to worry about it dropping out of my hand. Tested the hinge significantly, open and closing all week over the past seven days. A bit like a fidget tool, to be fair. And I've had no issues whatsoever. For me, this is a fantastic feature of this case. And it's one of the reasons that it stayed on my phone for the past seven days, because of that is extremely useful. Right, let's move on and take a look at the charger. In the box, as you can see, a bit of details, and that just tells you about the calling technology used on the charger to keep your phone cool whilst driving. You then receive some instructions on just how to install it. To be honest, it's very, very easy. You'll get USB-A to USB-C charger, which will give you about five watts. What I've been doing, I've been using a USB-C to USB-C, and that's gave me about 7.5 watts. So the charging speeds are actually quite good. And then you come to the charger itself. As you can say, it usually comes with a plastic seal on, but I've been using it all week. So it's got ESR in the middle, it's got like a glass material, which you can see, picks up fingerprints, but your phone goes on there, it's gonna be planted in your car, so that won't be a problem. And as you can see, around the outside, there is a vent where the fans are gonna be spinning to keep your phone cool. So that's the pass-through for the fans. You can actually see the fans are on the back, but the wind passes through, straight through to your phone. And then there's a slot here where this bit goes in, which was in the box. So it comes in two pieces and all you do is you've got the spinny thing, which makes it tighter or looser once it's on. And the head goes straight in, give it a spin. And that's in there nice and tight. You got a clip design. So this alligator grip goes onto your car vent. And then this bit you push down and it gives you a secure grip. As you can see, it does clip up and down, so it will tailor for various vents. Before we head to the car, let's just test how strong those magnets are. Okay, see a nice clamp. Okay, that's quite a significant shake, and it's not coming off. As you can see, I can just balance the whole thing on there. It doesn't come off. I actually have to pull it quite hard to get off, which is a good thing. Okay, so as you can see, when I had it in the car, ease installation, the magnets were amazing. Bit of a backstory, I used this for three hours in my journey down to Norfolk the other day on our family holiday. Three hours there, three hours back. The phone was on charge the whole time using the wireless charger and it didn't fall off once, didn't feel like it was gonna fall off once. And when I took it off the charger when we got there and when we got back both times, the phone was cool. So the fans did their job. You can hear them spinning a bit in the car, but it's nothing significant. Okay, so I thought it'd be good to test how strong the charger 
is without ESR's case, because I know ESR have really good magnets. I want to see how strong it is with no case on. Okay, so it does come off a lot easier. Yeah, so without the case on, definitely not as strong. Especially if you're gonna use the ESR charger, I'd probably use it with one of the ESR cases, just because the magnets are so strong in the ESR cases that it just lines up perfectly. Whereas if you're going caseless, I think because of the smooth design of the phone and the magnets from Apple probably not being as good, I wouldn't trust it personally, but I thought it important to show you guys that. So there's a bit of variety rather than just ESR's own case. But as far as ESR's case goes, highly, highly recommend this case. Very strong kickstand case, really good value for money. Before I give you the prices, jump down in the comment section and let me know what you guys think of these. Okay, so looking at prices, as far as the charger goes, you're looking at $38 in the US and $33.99 in the UK. And for the case, $21 in the US and £21 in the UK. Both extremely good value for money. Probably one of the strongest MagSafe cases I've tested so far. Fantastic car charger, which keeps your phone cool on your whole journey. And I will be continuing to use them every day. As I said, big thank you to ESR for sending these over. Just so you guys know, there is a link in the description if you wish to purchase them. It is an affiliate link, but it does help the channel out. Jump down in the comment section and let me know what you think of these two products. Are you using a different charger to this one? If so, let me know which one it is and then subscribe and I'll try and get around to reviewing it so I can compare it and also let me know if you find a better MagSafe case. Thank you for watching today guys, I'm Luke from Luke Tech Reviews, see you next time.